the other, not, uh, it's like your, mm -hmm. your um, blade of your hand's gonna go in the crick of their neck, so where their mm -hmm. occipital bone meets their neck, and push down so that you get that body motion. This is um, a Muay Thai clench, you know, whatever. I don't like this one again because he can still bull rush me in, and I have a problem now with a big man on top of me. Mm -hmm. The Krav one, right? Your gooseneck here, you have three different approaches here. Wrist, always gonna go back if you're gonna do it. Tricep, I don't particularly like. What I do if I do triceps is like this, so that I have more control than just using my hands. The other so thing- you're is, almost locking. I almost, like, lock. like, almost doing like a 360 defense. Mm -hmm. The other one is the underhook, right? The other difference you have here, this is the regular crab one, the gooseneck, which I'm putting all my forward mm -hmm. pressure forward so he doesn't come at me. I feel as though it's not as strong for me. Personal preference. Mine, I like this cross face. Mm -hmm. I have met nobody that can still take me down with a cross face like this or has the want to take me down with a cross mm -hmm. face like this. My personal opinion is I like the underhook. I know that not all instructors do because you're too close and you ha it's hard to get out. I'm little, I need that closeness to strike. So for me, now I'm at his side. So for me here, I'm not getting worried about getting bull rushed anymore. I can still use my cross face. And if I want to need even more control, here, right? Mm -hmm. So he, he's at my level now, this is what I need. I don't need that cross face anymore, but I can use it. I've eliminated the forward takedown, right? Mm -hmm. I can still throw him from here, pivot, throw him, anything that I want to do from here. I can bow him out, whatever I need to, right? So we have those couple of different things. My personal preference is the cross face and an underhook. I like to be to the side. I feel as though I'm usually smaller than most of my attackers, so I don't have to get down in order to get under his arm. It's almost like I'm hugging him. And then the blade of my arm right here where his little crick goes. It's amazing how he wants. My favorite thing is to make him do it for me. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm not, out, I'm not stronger than him. So my solution to it is make him move for me. That's freaking brilliant, right?